These days, it's not often people stay at the same job for more than two decades. But at one small town in South Dakota, at a grocery store, there's one man who's been punching his time card like clockwork every day for the past 24 years. Wade Keller started working at Payless Foods in Mobridge right out of high school. Turns out the job was a perfect fit for Wade and for the store. Jody Kurzman has the story. Hello. Wade Keller. How are you? Doesn't stay Good. in one place for too long. I like to be busy. He's constantly <laughs> on the move. All right. Straightening and restocking shelves. So they are closer for the customer to buy. Hello. Bagging groceries. How are you? And carrying them out for customers. Wade knows most of the people who shop here There's, by uh, name. Jeanette Wheeland. Those people. Back in uh, fifth grade, yeah. Are his favorite part of this job. I would say the the people, helping out the people. Yes, we do need some peaches. He's been helping people at Payless Foods since he graduated from Mobridge High School. Class of 1999. On this day his 44th birthday. So. He's celebrating by doing what he loves most, working at the grocery store. I work uh, Mondays through Fridays. Seeing people he knows. I've known his smiley face always. Oh, Steve. And oh, meeting no. new people. We get a lot of tourism during the summer, so there's some that come in I don't quite know, but those people are nice too. Wade's good. philosophy? Okay. If you're nice to customers, good. they'll be nice to you. Got it, okay. Customers say Wade's smile yes. and positive yes. attitude. Thank you, have a nice day. Are contagious. Wade is always that guy who's gonna tell you hi and always the person that you wanna take time to stop and say hi to too because of that. He's always friendly and willing to help. <laughs> He's pretty nice. There we go. Wade says it's pretty nice to be here. He's pretty sure he's found his place in this world. I think this is where I belong. The customers who shop at Payless would definitely agree. All right. In Mobridge, South Dakota, I'm Jody Kurzman, reporting for your news leader. When Wade isn't working, you'll probably find him at the Mobridge Aquatic Center during the summer. And during the winter, he's a big fan of all Mobridge Tigers sports. He tries to get to as many games as he can.